Okay, so what's in the water? Broad residents are about to find out as county leaders approve testing for certain dangerous chemicals. CBS News Miami's Joe Murray reports from Fort Lauderdale. Water everywhere, but what's in it? Shannon Harrison, who's lived in Broward 20 years, drinks nothing but tap water. He doesn't think about pollutants. No. <clears throat> Should I? If we can learn whether we have a PFAS issue. Broward Commissioner Mark Bogan thinks he should. He wants water countywide to be tested for chemical contaminants called PFAS, commonly called forever chemicals. Every day that you drink and I drink water, we want to make sure that it's not going to cause any harm. He points to FIU testing that found high levels of PFAS in Dania Beach. And this is not just isolated in Dania Beach, but this is everywhere. And, and the issue is really is what can PFAS do? It can cause cancer. It can cause so many diseases. It can cause so many problems. It's in almost every product that you have. Any person that cooks at their house that uses a stick-free pan has this. It's in all our sludge. It's in all our waste. It's in all of our plumbing stuff. They're going to find it if they do the test. But what does that mean? I think the public wants to know, and they should know. That's, that's what we are here for, to make the tough decision. Commissioners decided to test water at two county treatment plants. Shannon Harrison doesn't mind knowing. Tap water is not the way it used to be, I think, um, um, and it's concerning. Um, so, yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm in favor of that. So where will it all lead? Well, once we know what is in the water, commissioners are going to establish a process for figuring out how to treat it and how much it will cost. All these discussions will come up in June. In Fort Lauderdale, Joan Murray, CBS News, Miami.